Howdy, Possum Patty here, and I'm junk journaling. I think I'm going to do another page in my winter-themed little golden book, Memory Keeper. The last time I worked on the very first page, because I was inspired by these ornament fillers that I got at the dollar store. And today I think I want to do something with this black page because I want to do something with this sparkly silver ribbon that I bought at the Dollar Tree store. And I found this in my stash. This was just a practice watercolor doing some icicles. And I think I'm going to do something sparkly and make a pocket from this paper and that kind of looks nice because you got the snowflakes on the other side of that that's going to show and then on the inside I think I'm going to make some shaker cards and I'm going to use some of this other ornament filler material and because it's an icicle I found old pictures of Houses in the winter and the snow, gray skies and icicles hanging from the eaves. And I'm going to use this blue background for a little bit of color and then put in some of these little icy sequins. So that's the plan. So let's get started. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do my page is only this big, is cut some of these icicle tips to put on here. So do I want the top of the icicles or the bottom of the icicles? Let's see. I took a very pale blue aqua thread and just did a zigzag stitch, you can see on the back, around this nice sparkly ribbon. And then I made a pocket with that sheet of icicles. So that didn't take but a moment to do. So this is gonna be an easy page, but I think what I'm going to do now is take this Daniel Smith watercolor sample card Take some of this duochrome Cabo Blue. Kind of like a shimmery, sparkly blue. And just put a little bit on these icicles because I can't leave well enough alone. of a cool blue. I'm going to have to buy a tube of this paint because I really like it. I did buy a tube of this pearlescent shimmer, which I could add to this tube, but maybe I'll use that on another page. Just thought I'd run a little bit down the side of the icicle. Nice cool blue. And now what I'm going to do, let that dry. on these shaker cards, which is also a nice blue, cool blue. Now these cards are going to fit into this little bag. And then I'm going to put something across the edge and put these little sparkly things in there. So first step, all right, first step is to glue the pictures down and let that dry. So I'm going to do that first. 
Okay, I glued the pictures of the houses down to the blue card paper, cardstock paper. And what I was going to do was put both of the cards in the pocket I made with the icicle paper and then put some ribbon on the end and make them shaker cards. But I don't like the way it covers up all this shiny stuff. So I may put them in the pocket this way. And I put both. I could fit them both in this way. I just won't put the ribbons on them. And I will make them shaker cards, but I'm going to put them in like that so you can see this part, the shiny part. So, okay, now I need to put these in the little acetate envelopes. which I thought I cut to fit. <clears throat> I had to trim the little blue cards to get them to fit into the acetate envelopes. And what I'm going to do is put some filler in. These are from the dollar store. I think I'm going to put the white ones in this one. Is that too much? And I'm going to sew this across the top. And I think I'll put the silver ones in here. Oops, that's way too much. Way too many. Oop. Put them on the other side. It's a double sided shaker card. Okay, I'm going to go over to the sewing machine now and sew on the tops, and then these will be done. Okay, I sewed the tops on with a little zigzag stitch, and here's my shaker card, number one, with the icicles. And did the same thing for this card, shaker card number two, a little generous with my sequins in there. So now my cards are just going to go into the pocket. I can see a little bit of the sparkly edge. This was page number two in my The Colors of Winter, little golden book memory keeper junk journal. This was page number one. And this black paper page went right here. And that was fun. So thanks for coming along today. Happy junk journaling. Bye-bye now.